you. Okay. No, I mean, you. Hey guys, Dylan Schumacher, Daniel Richardson, Citadel Defense. So we're talking about. Oh yeah. So we're talking yeah. about uh, someday. A nice light topic. You're gonna die. Yeah. Um. So this is this is part of uh, kind of our thought on mindset, right? Um. There's gonna come a day. Could be today. Could be tomorrow. Hopefully, it's a long time from now. And you are going to die. Uh. Now, I, I don't say that to be depressing. I say that as it's a reality that we want you to deal with ahead of time. Uh, and the reason is, is because if you ever get in a life or death situation, or you're in an area where a mass shooter is deciding to make everyone say a bad day, and you can do something about it, and you decide to do something about it, we don't want that thought in the back of your mind of what it, the fear of death, like that haunting, gnawing, human condition fear of death. Right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. I mean, it is going to happen to you. There's no escaping it. One way or another, eventually it will. Sure. So it's important to face that fact now and deal with it now so that it doesn't um, get in the way of something important. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I think it'll make you a better fighter. It, it'll make you a better warrior when, when you've dealt with that ahead of time. So today could be your last day, and, and you're, you're at peace with that. And I think... I mean, so Daniel and I are Jesus guys, okay, right? Cards on the table. Like, so I think the only way to really deal with that is, is to know God and to know Jesus, and, and you can meet him through your Bible, and I'm sure there's a solid church in your area, and you can do that. Um, if you don't like that, I, I'm sorry, but we'd love to talk about that sometime. Point is, is you have to deal with that because it's going to make you a, a better, more capable, and more able fighter. If you're afraid of dying in that moment, you might just peace out. You, you, might, you might not stand in the gap to do something about it. Um, so, you know, there's a uh, John over at Active Self Protection, right? Great channel. Watch that if you haven't. Uh, he calls it spiritual fitness. And I like that term. I think it's a great, great term. And so we, we, we want you to have spiritual fitness. We want you to be okay, at peace with the day that you're going to die. And if today's your day and you go out trying to do something right, if you go out as a hero, that's a win. We'll take that. We'll take that, you know? And if you go out saving people, um, and, and laying your life down for other people, that's a good thing. We'll take that. But you're not going to do that if you're not at peace with that ahead of time. So do brave deeds and endure. Like, dislike, comment below. Um, thanks, guys.